Ruski Ed here with another geography lesson. Look over the list of geographical locations to be covered in this lesson during the intro song. Ruski Ed is his name, and speaking Russian is his game. If it is Russian, you would like to know, the Ruski Ed is the place to go. As you undoubtedly realize, Russia is a very large country. In fact, it has nine time zones. Such a large country contains many interesting geographical locations to learn about and explore, and in this lesson, we'll take a look at six more of them. So, Davitya absudim geografiu rasii, or Davitya pogavarim o geografii rasii, both of which mean, let's discuss the geography of Russia. In fact, let's do it now. As you can see on this map, from west to east, we have the Caucasus Range, St. Petersburg, Yekaterinburg, Mount Narodnaya, Irkutsk, and the Kamchatka Peninsula in English, and Kavkazki Hrabet, St. Petersburg, Yekaterinburg, Gora Narodnaya, Irkutsk, and Palo Ostrov, Kamchatka in Russian. Possibly the most interesting item on this list is Mount Narodnaya, which just so happens to be the highest peak in the Ural Range. Although at only 6,217 feet, it's not exactly a terribly tall mountain, it is nonetheless the highest mountain in the Ural Range, or in other words, Gara Narodnaya Yavlayatsya Samai Vesokai Vershinaev Oralskam Hrepta, which means Mount Narodnaya is the highest summit in the Ural Range. Speaking of mountains, it only stands to reason that a large country like Russia would contain many mountain ranges, and possibly the most famous of all the ranges in Russia is the Caucasus Range, often simply called Kavkaz. It may also be referred to as Kavkazki Hrebet, which means Caucasus Range, or Kavkazki Gori, which means Caucasus Mountains. Moving to the opposite side of the country, we have the Kamchatka Peninsula, or Palo Ostrov Kamchatka, in Russian which is famous for live volcanoes. As for cities on the list, we have St. Petersburg, which is the second largest city in Russia, Irkutsk, which is located near Lake Baikal, and Yekaterinburg, which is just east of the Ural Range. It should be noted that St. Petersburg was at one time known as Leningrad. Here's a list of the six geographical locations covered in this lesson again. Kavkaz means Caucasus, St. Petersburg means St. Petersburg, Yekaterinburg means Yekaterinburg, Gora Narodnaya means Mount Narodnaya, Irkutsk means Irkutsk, and Palo Ostrov Kamchatka means Kamchatka Peninsula. And now for a few review words in a couple of sentences. Chilavek means person or man. Uja means already or by now. Praiti means to pass, to walk, or to go. Kaji means every or each. Got means year. And, Gavaritz means to say, to tell, or to speak. Our first review sentence goes like this. Yisho Adin got Uja Prashol, which means another year has already passed. It should be noted that Prashol is a form of Praiti. Sentence number two is as follows. Kashti Chilavek Budet Gavaritz, which means each person will speak. And that's it for this lesson. Ruskiad, signing up now. Das Vidanya!